Tage Thompson just went beast mode, scoring a hat trick against the Devils to make the comeback after being down two. And his first goal was dandy as he gets the puck poke checked away, but catches it and just keeps going, ripping one on Allen, who just can't hang on. Buffalo now down one. And Thompson's hand eye is just kind of ridiculous, especially when combined with his reach and his size. He's just scooping it out of the air. I love it. I feel like we talked about that a lot last year, less so this year, as I alluded to in a prior video. And many have speculated that Thompson was playing through injury and came back a bit too early. His second goal, just a bit of lazy-ass defense and puck movement by the Devils in their own zone as they give it up to Tuck, who gives it up to Thompson. And you already know, snipes it bar down, tied 2-2. Nice one by him again. And this time, he just beat Allen clean. There's no what if on this one. But yeah, what's going on here, New Jersey? Like, like, you've got an easy outlet pass to Timo, who's just sitting by the We Make Doctors ad, but they go for the back pass, which is miscommunicated, and then in the back of the net. Just a silly mistake to make at this point in the game when safer options are available. But away she goes, and we're back to the third, where Tage completed the Hattie. Four and a half to go, Darlene fires it on net, and it squeaks through Allen, just sitting there for the tap-in as Tage grabs his sixth career hat trick. He'd also go on to add an empty netter and grab a nice four-goal game while also grabbing the win and keeping all those good points away from the Devils. And for me, that's actually the really big shock of this game is that if Jersey had won, they would have been up to 78 points, which would have put them three back behind the Washington Capitals, who now occupy that final wildcard spot. And they also would have been just behind Detroit as well. Instead, now they're five points and three spots out behind not just Detroit and Washington, but also the Islanders. And they do not have the friendliest of schedules remaining. So not only was this game against Buffalo a massive waste, it may have actually killed their season. The Devils now have just eight games left. That's Pittsburgh, the Rangers, Ottawa, then the Preds, a home and home with Toronto, ending with Philly and the Islanders. And that last game, I mean, depending on how things shape up could be very interesting, but that's a pretty tough remaining schedule, and I honestly don't think they'll even be close to that wild card spot. I thought maybe before this one, but this sealed it for me. What do you think? Do you think the Devils can still make it in, or did Tage Thompson just hammer the nail in the coffin of their season? Let us know below.